tonight from Ford Field in Detroit. It's a special prime time edition of the NFL on EA Sports. the Tampa Bay Buccaneers taking on the Buffalo Bills. First open in 2002. There's a look inside Ford Field here in downtown Detroit, the Motor City. Tonight, we've got the crew set for what should be a real treat, a great Monday night matchup between the Buffalo Bills and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Set now to kick this one away, and off it goes. Andre Roberts now to return it. And a good effort on the return there. Gets him across the 30, up to the 33. So here come the Bills on offense for the first time. And a look here at their go-to guy under center. What I enjoyed this week is that you asked to talk to his offensive center before the game and find out a little bit more about him and what the relationship is. And that was a pretty positive story, wasn't it? Yeah, and really what I took away from that is just how it has permeated throughout the entire offensive line, the relationship they've had. It's really a group that's in sync. They care about him. That's the thing. They really care. And when you care that much, you're going to play that much harder for him and give him a better chance to lead the team that wins. Complete crisis averted, almost picked. Instead, second down. I think he's got to be careful not to force anything into coverage right there. There weren't really any throwing lanes, but the best part for him, he's got second and third down to fall back on. Oh, he dropped it. They were looking for him in the middle third. He couldn't catch it. Now third down. Maybe just a lack of concentration there as he couldn't haul it in. And when you're going across the middle like that, you know, he's running that drag route, you are conscious of all the bodies and the traffic in there. But let's face it, if you're going there, you might as well come down with the football and absorb whatever else happens after that. Eluding the pressure right. He may try to run for this. And the tackle going to be made at the 41 as they stop him a few yards short of the first. Their opening drive here is going to result in a punt. They got seven yards there, but not enough. So still a scoreless game in the first, but they're going to go for this thing on their own side of the field on fourth down. And some room to work. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. A curious decision to go for it, but it pays off for the first down. I don't believe that that was called right here in the moment. I believe this was called during practice this week, that he was going to decide to be aggressive even on his own side of the field. Just you mean because it's the opening drive? Maybe they had this scripted? I think that he just talked about it with his team and said, listen, I'm confident in you. If we end up in this situation, we'll go for it early just to set a tone in this game. Now this one is tied in out on the right side. They'll get this one down near the 20-yard line, just shy of the 20. More a good pick up there, 26 yards. Down. Nice job there of utilizing his big target. He didn't overthink it. Understands the catch radius. Understands that he knows how to use his body to keep defenders away from the ball. And puts it right out there for the nice pickup. Back to throw now on first down. And this one is incomplete. From the 21, it's second and 10. He's still caught. He the five. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Buffalo touchdown. From 21 yards away. And the Bills have taken the early lead. 
those are the drives that prove a lot. You got a rookie quarterback, Charles, you're on the road, takes him down, throws the touchdown pass. And in a game like this, with, as you described, a rookie quarterback, the team usually says, okay, we got to take care of this guy. We got to protect him. But when he goes out and plays like this on the first drive on the road, he doesn't have to say, I'm here to be your leader. They just need to follow him. And it's 7 nothing Buffalo. So up a seven play drive on total and it culminates in a Bills touchdown. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. Takes it at the seven. Solid return, pretty good field position. They'll start at the 32. So out come the Bucks now for their first drive. And a glance here at their quarterback standing six foot three. And what I'm looking for from him today, the things every quarterback is looking to do, lead his team to a victory. Doesn't matter whether he's throwing it, running it, handing it off, however he has to do it, as well as exhibiting some leadership, that's what he's trying to accomplish. From the 32 now, here's first and 10. Now back to throw. And it's a short one here, complete to his tight end. Three yards the gain there, second down. Brandon, to me, what's important right here on this drive is for them to get at least two first downs. They've got to give their defense a chance to settle down, catch their breath a little bit after they give up a touchdown on the opening drive. And the hole closes quickly there. He gets maybe a couple up to the 38. Now we're going to get a timeout. Appears we've got an injured Buccaneer. While the training staff takes a peek, we'll take a break. An extra defensive back here for the Bills on third down. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. And he's got his man in stride, complete. The pass. There's an example of good situational football being played by a defense. They understood where the third down play was, the down and distance, and made sure that they didn't get anywhere near that bringing up fourth down. Yeah, they were sniffing out that marker, didn't want to let him get close to there, and now a likely three and out to start. Yeah, I love the way they rallied to the football, got to it, and made sure they didn't give up much run after catch. So here come the Bills out for their second drive. They've got a 7 nothing lead in the football as well as they start out first and 10. shotgun he'll look to throw and Matthews over the middle with a grab That's good. and brought down but not before reaching the 45 yard line this drive starting off on the right foot 18 yards well we can talk about it like it's just a basic route but how about the timing on this one lined up on the right runs a deep in route and how about the throw right on the money bam puts it right in there and on his hands Nice completion. Really good pickup. There to stop him on the tackle, Jack Cicci. Oh, that's a real nice job there by the defensive front. They just engaged and held their ground. But how about the guy who made the play? We often talk about whether they take a good first step or not. Many times, you just don't take any step. Just get your... 